Hello, I'm Sergeant Tony Gomes with the Humboldt County Sheriff's Office. I'm Chandler Bronson and I'm a deputy with the Humboldt County Sheriff's Office. My name is Travis Rogers. I'm a deputy sheriff with the Humboldt County Sheriff's Office. My name is Eric Masaki. I'm a deputy with the Humboldt County Sheriff's Office. I'm Greg Musson. I'm a sergeant with the Humboldt County Sheriff's Office. I'm Hillary Holt. I'm a detective with the Humboldt County Sheriff's Office and I am a Measure Z employee. I'm a Measure Z employee. I'm a Measure Z employee. And I'm a Measure Z employee. Being a deputy sheriff, I respond to a variety of different calls. We've done everything from uh, assisting medical agencies with, with just helping out people that are in need of medical care. From child abuse cases and protecting children in the community or homicide investigations. We respond to if there's some sort of disturbance, a, a, a fight, or even just people arguing, not getting along, and it feeling a little uneasy about it, we, we respond and we do everything we can to, to maintain order and keep the peace. A lot of everything. Helping all different types of people in all different types of situations and just being able to be there and handle the situations as they need to be handled. CID is our Criminal Investigations Division. Um, we investigate crimes such as homicide, child crimes, missing people, um, a variety of different crimes. Through Measure Z, we are able to open the Trinity River Station in Willow Creek, and I'm currently assigned as a patrol sergeant in that area. Currently I'm assigned out to um, the Hoop on Willow Creek areas with the Sheriff's Office, so I do patrol out there. I work the weekend graveyard shift. I generally work down in Southern Humboldt uh, in the nighttime, so I do the graveyard shift. Measure Z really um, added um, coverage to the outlying areas of the county. I was really surprised when I started working in Southern Humboldt and I'd be there at, you know, two, three in the morning. A lot of people acted surprised and some of them even said, I thought you guys weren't down here after like midnight. Without the Major D funding, we didn't have coverage out there 24 hours a day. It could take an hour up to two hours uh, to get to a call if you don't have deputies out there in those outstation areas already pre-positioned, uh, which we do under a fully staffed situation. Without the Major Z funding, there wouldn't be enough deputies on the streets to fill those spots. Now that we have the better staffing, uh, we're able to be there down in Southern Humboldt 24-7. They're, they're really happy that when they call, they don't have to wait an hour for someone to get there. We can be there in five minutes, and, and they're really happy to see us there because we can take care of the problem and, and find a good solution for everyone instead of waiting an hour for things to brew before that happens. Yeah, I'm very fortunate to work in a community that supports public safety. I wouldn't be in this position if it wasn't for that. You know, I grew up here, never left, and always wanted to be here. It's nice to be around where you know and the people that you can help are the people you know.